Hey, John Fink here from Doom HQ. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to add spark objects to your maps. Okay, as you can see, I've created a little computer terminal here, and the sparks are going to give it the effect that it's shorting out. So, to actually add the spark, you'll go into Thing Mode, go to Z Doom, and then Spark, and give it a tag of 1. Since I already got my object, I'm going to remove that. Um, next, for my effect, I want it to also uh, flicker the light in this area to give it a little more character and whatnot. So for that, we go to sector mode. Also gave it a tag of one. And now the thing is, uh, sparks don't just spark continuously. Um, you actually have to use like a thing activate to activate the spark. So and then use a little script to loop it so it'll have continuous sparks. So in, like in this case I have a script that will load when it opens and it's going to activate the spark so it, sh uh, it, act it throws off sparks. I'm changing the raising the light value and at a delay of 4 and the reason the delay is in between the two change values is everything in the game goes on 30 seconds of a second. So if you, without the small delay it would just you would never see the flicker actually happen. Uh, so the, after that, we use I'm using a delay random between 20 and 60, which is a a pretty good uh, value to use as far as um, the distance between the two numbers. So it gives a really good uh, random sh shorting effect. And then we just restart the script and run it indefinitely. So once you have all that in place, it should look like this. And that's all there is to it. Um, stay tuned for my next tutorial.